Hello, everybody, and welcome to another edition of Being Real. I am Joe. Get used to the face. Get used to the pace. We move quickly, and we do so to get you down your path to financial independence. Speaking of which, today we are going to be talking about ending the cycle of living paycheck to paycheck, unless you're happy doing it, but I think most people aren't. And honestly, folks, I can tell you, you've been doing it for a while. It'll take a little bit of time, but it's just not that hard to do. Okay, bear with me, bear with me. You're saying, I'm trying hard, I'm trying hard. I know you're trying hard. And sometimes we're swimming against the current. So we need to stop doing that. It's all about where we place our effort, okay? Where are you putting your effort? And what results are you getting? Let's talk about that. First things first, what you need to do is reach out and hit the like button and subscribe button if you haven't done that already. I sure would appreciate it and help us get this out, this information out to as many people as possible. Now, what I'm gonna need you to do, what everyone needs to do, is to have a budget, unless you are wealthy, unless you honestly don't need to look at your bank book. That's fine. My bank book. Well, that tells you how old I am. <laughs> Anybody got a bank book out there? Put it in the comments section below if you have a bank book. Yeah, probably not. Uh, the first thing you have to do is you have to have a budget. And folks, you just have to have a budget. And I know that it's so easy to not do this. Um, you know, I've been there, done that. You know, I've absolutely been there and done that. It's hard to look at reality in the face, especially when it's beating you down every day. But you've got to sit down and you have to make a budget. You have to have an idea of what's going on in your financial life if you're going to fix it. And I'm telling you, you don't have to do this every night. And you don't have to do it overnight, I should say. And you don't have to do it to the point where it's crippling you. You're already being crippled. You just don't know it. Or maybe you do know it. So the first thing we're going to do is make this budget. And how are we going to do that? Just sit down and sketch out a rough estimate. This is true. Just a rough estimate. Don't put any pressure on yourself. We're not saying, you know, here's, you're going to write this down, then you have to live by it for the rest of your life. Absolutely not. You write it down. What are your costs? What are your fixed costs? And write those down. What is your rent or mortgage? You know, what is your car payment? What is your insurance payment? What is your medical insurance payment? The fixed costs that you have in your life. And then you're going to have quasi fixed stuff like, you know, what do you think you're spending on fuel? What do you think you're spending on groceries? you know, buying diapers or whatever else it is. We know these are all thoughts because we don't know right now. If you do know already and you have a budget, great. We're just going to move on to part two. But for those who haven't done this yet, you have to sit down and do it. And then for the next month, that's right. For the next month, I need you to write down. You need to keep a log. You need to keep a log of everything you spend your money on. And I'm not telling you what to spend your money on, not spend your money on. I just want you to make a log of it. And I'm not telling you it's right or it's wrong. Just make a log of it so that at the end of the month, maybe even two weeks, but at the end of, really, it's after two weeks, we can really get an idea. But after a month, we definitely know where the spending is going. Where is the money going? You know how much you have coming in every month. You know that. It's like clockwork. A lot of you are sitting there looking at the, uh, looking at the uh, bank account online, waiting for that deposit to go through on Thursday night or Friday night before the actual payday the following day. You know what the amount is coming in. What you need to know is what is the amount going out and where is it going. And it's not a judgment of right or wrong. Don't get caught up in that. It's just knowing where it's going so that we can make choices. And then, and only then, can we make the choices that are going to be effective. You have to do this, folks. You absolutely have to. And I know straight up that most of you won't. And... You know, I don't, I don't want to say that's okay, but that's the way it goes, I, sh I, I guess I could say. But if you're really interested in getting out of the paycheck to paycheck cycle, you have to start here. This is just the start. You have to start with this budget that I just told you. And you don't have to scrimp or save or do anything right now. You just have to have a budget. You have to know where your money's going so you can make choices, so you can make a plan. And until you take step one, you can't do steps two and three. Okay, so you have to do step one. Lay out that budget that you know your fixed cost and your quasi-fixed cost. And then start tracking for the next two weeks to 30 days, 15 to 30 days, exactly where you spend every dime. Every dime. If you spend something, you need to write it down. There's no judgment. And look at it at the end of the month and find out where the money is going. And then you can judge how to start fixing things. 
that is the very first step. And I am more than happy to help you with the second and third and fourth steps afterwards. Remember, I give a free one hour consultation. All you have to do is put a comment in the section below and we'll get together. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll find each other and we can, we can sit down and do that. There's no charge at all, but you have to do that for me. You have to be willing to start somewhere. And that's knowing what the issues are. And if you see it in black and white, once you see it in black and white, I'm telling you right now, it's a huge, huge help. It's a huge help because now you know, now you're conscious of what you're spending your money on. And now going forward from there and for those people who have already already set it within a budget and they're saying, they're going, Joe, come on, I already have a budget and we're, you know, this is what we spend and this is all we spend, but we're still struggling to get by and it's paycheck to paycheck. And we're one of 70% of Americans who are living paycheck to paycheck and one of over 75% of Americans that don't even have a thousand dollars in the bank to save or that is saved. These are scary numbers, folks. That's scary for you, scary for the country, but we're going to fix it because remember what we do here is teach a path to financial independence. And mostly we do that through real estate, but we can't start you on that path until we have the first steps taken. So I need you to do that for me today. And then we can start to sit down and talk about the easy steps. I mean, do you have an hour a day? You do. And if you don't, we'll find one for you. We'll find you an hour a day. I don't care how many kids you have. I don't care how long you're working. I don't care what, what else is going on. You have an hour a day. You may not think so right now, but you do. You do. Trust me. And we're going to sit down and we're going to tell you exactly what to do with that hour a day. And in that hour a day, we're going to turn you into a profitable machine. I'm, I'm just being serious. I'm not selling you something here. This is free. This is all free. You give me an hour a day and I'll tell you what to do. And we'll go out there and start making a difference to where you can start seeing a real difference in your financial life. You can see it. You will realize it. You have to take the first steps first. Do those things to show that you're actually going to follow through because following through is the hardest part. Honestly, it is, folks. It's not that hard to get out of debt and to get out of the, the paycheck to paycheck cycle. It's not. Just most people don't do it. They have other choice. They make other choices and they choose. I've seen it. I've been around for a long, long time. And that is their choice. And that may be your choice. And that's okay too. I'm not judging. I'm telling you, if you want to get out of it, this is the first step. Take this first step and we'll take the other ones together. Okay. Do that. Sit down. Write down your budget, and for the next 15 to 30 days, you're going to write down every penny you spent. Every penny you spent. While you're doing that, you're going to give me an hour a day. Get in touch with me. We'll go through it. We'll go through how to do it. You're going to give me an hour a day. Five hours a week is what I'm asking for. So you can pick whichever five is out of seven days you want. You give me an hour a day, and while you're doing that, we're going to start you down the real path to finding some nice chunks of profit that you can start working on right now. Right now, you don't have to have a penny. You don't have to have any credit. You don't have to have anything. You can start doing it right now and you're going to see solid financial returns and you're going to see this whole thing come together. All right, it's up to you. It is 100% up to you. What are you going to do now? Let me know.